Hi, I'm Dave Mollard, I'm Business Development Manager at Straypoint, and each week I'm bringing a new technical tip to you on one of our products. Uh, so following on from last week's video, we looked at the Blue Link, which is a Bluetooth product, and we connected it to your smartphone. And we did a very simple data logging function, which is that we did uh, manual data logging. That's shown by the hand icon in the top right hand corner. And what that means is every time you press the uh, record button, it will just grab one weight from the load cell. Now there's some other functions um, under data logging, which are in user settings. So here we can see uh, the different data logging functions available to you. So we can see we've also got timed while overload and while underload. So let's see what each of those looks like now. So here we've set data logging to timed and that's shown by the stopwatch icon in the top right hand corner of the screen. And we've got two buttons, start and stop. So as soon as we press start, it will then start to grab data from the load cell every one second. And you'll see that every second, the top right hand corner, the indicator flashes up to say it's grabbed one data point. So the next logging function is while overload, and that's signified by the up arrow in the top right hand corner. And we also need to set an alarm for this to tell it what an overload condition is. So it was a simple example. I've set this at 10 kilos. So as soon as we go above 10 kilos, um, it will show overload and it will start logging the data from the load cell. And then back under that 10 kilo threshold. Now the third type of logging we're looking at today is while under load. So now I've set it that any time we are under 10 kilos, then the alarm will sound. So then when we go above 10 kilos, it will just show the value. But then below 10 kilos, you get the overload alarm. Now this is popular for when you're using a running line tension meter um, and you want to monitor for a slack line situation. So just to be clear, for the while overload and while underload conditions, you need to set an alarm um, in the settings um, and the while overload is particularly good for capturing any kind of overload um, and logging data uh, while the lifting equipment is in an overload situation and while underload particularly for slack line situations. So hopefully um, each of those um, logging functions brings something to you. Um, let me know how you get on with those features. Thanks for watching.